Hello everyone, I see Wamsha Chukwabilago. Welcome to yet another wonderful video on TBC. Today I'll be showing you guys how to do transaction verification. Okay, especially if somebody bought TBC from you. Okay, or maybe you bought TBC from somebody. Okay, so without uh, much, let me just go straight to my Tringo Cash account because I have some transaction verification to verify. Okay, so let me just log in. So I'm logged into my account and I will go straight and show you guys first of all how to find the transaction verification in your Kringle Cash back office. I've done the video before, but that was with the old uh, you know design of the Kringle Cash platform. But right now, this is a much better design and some things have been relocated so let me just go straight and show you guys so in the case of transaction verification you should be able to go to account is there account sorry rewards not account you go to reward when you go to rewards you can see your cookie reward okay you can see your cookie reward you can see broadcast transfer reward then when you click on transaction verification it gives you two options confirm transaction and confirmation request now if you bought tbc from somebody you are the one to initiate transaction registration uh, transaction verification so how do you do that because you are the receiver because you bought from somebody so you're going to receive you have to go to confirmation request okay when you click the confirmation request it's going to give you show you it's going to uh, give you access to be able to do that so let me all right so this is what you're going to see when you click on uh add um on confirmation request if you are a buyer okay or if you bought from somebody then you click on add request let me just show you guys briefly what you've been required to provide before i now head over to show you guys how to for those people who sell okay if you sold tbc to someone okay then you are going to confirm the verification request okay so this is what is going to require it's going to require your name your last name it's going to require the amount in usd that was transacted it's going to require your wallet address the date of transaction time of transaction amount of transaction in kringles method of payment and the trusted seller's email okay so if I, if you bought tbc from me what you should use is chooks y2j2000 at gmail.com that's what you should use okay all right so when you do that you click submit now if you don't have all the information instead of you going to make mistake click on save okay when you click on save it allows you to come back okay and update what you've already provided before before you now click submit so if you're not sure what you're providing enter the ones you know click on save then when you get the information you now come complete the form and click submit now having said that let me show you guys how to confirm transaction so you go to rewards transaction verification confirm transaction now i should have one pending if the person that bought from me okay if the person that bought from me actually sent a request the right way okay so right here these are all the people that have bought from me previously okay in the past these are all the transaction verification i've done so i should be looking for the latest transaction and that was the one done by rich of 5050 that is on 15th may okay as you can see okay that's the amount 105.5 that he received so i have to pr approve this transaction so okay you know previously in the tbc004 okay there used to be this address that is your own wallet address appearing here but since we entered to uh, 009 it doesn't appear anymore so what you're going to see you see where it appears okay this is the buyer's this is the buyer's wallet address okay this is meant to be your wallet address but it no longer appears okay so this is where it appears now this is where this is called uh, transaction id 
so this is how transaction id is right now both of us don't see it because only the admin can see it from the back end okay so in this case now uh i have to confirm the information so yes so this is his email address this is my own email address okay this is the transaction id and this is the amount he received so i'm going to go ahead and click approve so i'm going to zoom in to avoid mistake okay and he paid with bitcoin so for those of you guys who are looking for ways to actually buy to actually convert tbc to bitcoin okay you have to find somebody who has bitcoin or the person has to contact you okay because if the person has to contact you and say hey i want to buy and pay with bitcoin okay there's no automatic online okay and there's no automatic uh, online platform that you will go and you put tbc and they will give you btc no there's not okay all you have to do is keep promoting tbc somebody definitely will contact you okay if you keep marketing tbc someone will definitely contact you the person will definitely decide to pay with naira or decide to pay with paypal or decide to pay you via moneygram uh western union because i have received payment for tbc via western union for somebody in australia i've received payment from money with moneygram same australia um, I've received payment via Bitcoin a couple of times from India and right now from Mr. Richard Ofori. I don't know which country is it. Probably it's in Nigeria or probably he's in Ghana or South Africa. Okay. I think probably it's in Ghana because uh, I remember our email correspondent shows he's in Ghana. Okay. So that means he's in Ghana. So for him to be able to pay me, he can pay me with Ghana City. So definitely he's going to look for the fastest means which is bitcoin and that's why he paid me with bitcoin there's no other reason okay there's no other reason so i've done the confirmation so it's uh the up to the tbc had made to reward him his bitcoin for purchasing hundred dollar worth of tbc okay so that's it for how to do transaction verification i'll show you guys how to initiate transaction verification for somebody who bought from if you are if you bought for tbc recently for somebody okay and if the person who bought from you initiate transaction verification so that he or she can earn cookies okay to earn cookies then you have to confirm the transaction before the person earns any cookies so i'm showing you guys how to confirm transaction so if you have any question concerning this please ask me you can come okay contact me via email whatsapp call or you can you know simply comment in the session on the comment section below and I will answer your question. So, guys, so I'll see you guys next time. Remember, if you don't have the Billion Coin app, make sure to get it. It's the number one place you can get first hand information about TBC and, most importantly, receive push notifications, receive notifications whenever there is a blog update. And, most importantly, manage your portfolio from Kringo Cash to Wallet and also getting across to support. So, guys, that's it for now. Take care and bye for now.